An overloading blind pestle. You know overloading blind pestle and actually sick the orb to your character, so you're scared of them for no reason. Pretty cool. I like Gearbox and hope you know about that one, so if it's ever fixed, uh, you're welcome. Oh, that's beautiful. Uh, I don't really want to give up the hook, but I'm acknowledging that I need speed as well. So I don't know. Kind of on the fence. A lot of drones. I think we got drone. Hook for his energy drink. Hook will always be better every time. Uh, only situation which it's like not really is like, I don't know, just when you're playing Huntress or something, or Merc, maybe. Hook doesn't just speed up you you walking, it speeds up your running, but it also speeds up when you're using abilities. There's nothing worse than being slowed down when you're trying to use Desperado or Lights Out or something, and you just want to shoot and go fast. Or just any ability. I'll go for random here. Actually, yeah, I will. Thank you. Actually, kind of AoE centric. I would have gone for the slug had there not been a healing drone, but there is, so. And then we'll come back and play the void, and hopefully it'll be a poly loot. Or a plant. We'll pick up the plant this time, guys. Trust. <laughs> Let's just use the Gubo here. Dude, the Gubo actually hit his grenade. What the hell? This game. He's not shooting. He's broken. Buddy. Okay, he's using grenades now. Again. <laughs> Got a feather, nice. Well, GG, I guess. I'm surprised people could actually hit nades sometimes. I mean, maybe it was just the fact that it was, like, right up against the boss or so. But... Void Scent or Will of Us? Oof. Void Scent all of the time that you don't have an FMP or something, probably. Void Scent's so fucking good, dude. But FMP is also really fucking cool, too. So, yeah, I don't know. If you have an FMP in Prospect, don't pick it up, but otherwise you did. You will only come around when you get a license to lower Void Scent on stage 1 and 2. True. Thank you. Exactly what I wanted. I can get rid of the back of my here and get a little speed. We already have enough AOE, I think. No god pot, sad. I don't want guillotine. Probably gonna take the syringe. Fireworks? Interesting prospect. Roach? Wrong. If there's a scrapper, I think I'll just go into uh, fireworks or something. I don't know. Fire potential is huge here. So we already have something that procs with it like every time. This map color scheme kind of reminds me of the OG Temple Run game. I never played enough of that game. I played it like once and I was like, I don't get the hype because it's a, like a mobile arcade game and then I uninstalled it. Every mobile game that became popular, I never understood. <laughs> I don't know, I just, I can't be the only one. Okay. Saw nothing. So you could probably use it for the TP boss so quick though if you want to get it done quick. Another bird cradle is pretty good. And with a recycler in my hand. I don't think Sunny is bad on commando at all, but I'm gonna reroll it anyway. Fuck. Nice. Sham. No scrappy though, it's like we're not going um fireworks. Hello. Greater Wisp, hello. What do you want from me? Why are there so many minions here? I'm barely able to out DPS them when I have to do with bands. <laughs> because the minions are so strong that they're on the cliff. Just let me kill them. Just let me kill them. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Why are these minions here? I just got comboed by two whips. I hate when Wisp push you into the ground, that shit is so annoying. On the math, on chest versus shrine, in what sense? Because it's about like, five times as costly. Oh, I fucked up. It's okay, we have another backup pot, and this is also not something we have to do, but I feel like I need to practice one, because I don't do it ever. I do this one like about once a month, so... Obviously. It's a little bit too fast coming in there. Oh! Hold it more than I wanted to. Oh, I couldn't get it over the way I wanted it to. Oh, oh, that bun that rolled down the hill. I just alt it forward. It's not too bad. I usually get it pretty easy, but I don't know. I'm just not today, I guess. You gotta be really, really slow with them. Thank you. 
Button mechanics is like such a random mechanic for the game. Just to be clear for everybody, uh, the button mechanic was never meant to be done by one person, except with energy turrets. Pot rolling was never supposed to be a factor in the game. Before anyone says it's weird, because it was actually never intended. So yeah, it's weird. And now a lot of people get on the game for that. It's like, this is a stupid mechanic. It's like, it's not. You're doing it like work around a method. Eh. Hey man, this ain't good. How'd you get up here? Ow. The damage isn't nearly enough. Great time. Bye bye. Oh, I don't do that. Alrighty. ATG, beautiful. Any more plump action? Thank you. Have you done any ARPGs? Not any, like, Diablo Path of Exile ones, no. I'm just not really big into the games like that, where they're just, like, designed to be... I don't know, like, they feel like Risk of Rain looping all the time, you know what I mean? Where you're just, like, picking up shit that has, like, a slightly better... slightly better number on it that you can't really feel a difference to. Not my favorite. Is it killing everything in PvP by walking takes skill? Yeah, it's really hard to shut up. <laughs> this barrier, thanks. It's not from Aegis. Literally plays PoE while working out? Yeah, because it's... It's like Cookie Clicker, but... It pretends to be an RPG. Which I think is funny. And you can get mad at me for that, but... <laughs> That's what it is. Ooh, Double Shark is really good. I'm gonna reroll that. You know, take, I'll take, we don't even have any fucking bleed right now, so. I need some damage. You guys have any tips for Merc? I'm stuck on his E1 for three days. I usually down stage five with a moon. What skills are you using? If you're using Eviscerate, I'd say switch off Eviscerate. I think the closest I ever played to an ARPG would just be Roman the Mad God, which is arguably an ARPG. But it's not, it doesn't come with the same genre specific uh, difficulty sliders, I think. That's why I like to play more. I'll expose build and default secondary. Hmm. Add stage fire of the moon. I don't know, that's a tough one. Why do you feel like you died in stage five? Hey, they're getting sickle, take too long to come up this time to die. Uh how fast do you go through stages? I'm gonna stage five for five minutes. Hmm. I don't know. Cause if you're dying on E1, that's uh that is monsoon, right? So there is something something up. Do you have any other characters up further? Because like either it's like a situation where it's Merc or it's E1. Do I have any wraps or anything? Not really. I could get like some laser penny money. Uh oh. Do you prefer phase round or phase blast? I prefer phase round actually. I like the uh, the AoE of it. I like uh, piercing for band procs. I think it's fun. I know a lot of people like blast though. I think it's okay to like blast. I might be E1 with really easily. It's just Merc. Hmm. It might be a situation where I just say you just have to practice with Merc, because I don't know specifically what you're doing wrong, because I can't see you play. It might just be a matter of positioning or something, that I just, like, don't have the ability to see. I try to do phase round, but I can barely kill anything since I have no single target damage. I like the grenades and the phase round. I need this. I don't want that, but that's fine. Commando, the M1 such a single target kind of thing, I don't really... Want to overinvest in other versions of it? I'd rather have like more AOE and band proc stuff. Since uh, Shurikens came out, the value of phase round has gone down a little bit. That's still pretty good. Oh, do you think I'll play any Risk Rain Returns on Serum War? Yeah, I'd say I'd play some more. I'll probably go back to it once there's an update. I feel like I bursted through it and I kind of got everything I kind of really wanted to done. I might go back earlier than an update, but we'll see. The thing is, is there's no Eclipse climb. Like, there's no like long term goal. Right? It's just, will you win again and again and again? At least like here with this grand too, I'm still trying to, still even now, get better at Umbral. So, even today I've died a couple times already. Whatever. But like Providence, like, 
Push out judgment, and we're just wondering how you go about it. Once mining is my first turn, it'll be a huge boost for content. I agree. Definitely when modding is out, it's be really interesting. How many is again? Just rain returns. Something like almost 200, uh, which is interesting because I feel like a lot of the the sentiments around the game at the start were people saying it was just like way harder. But I just think I had said this as well a lot, but like I feel like people just need to put more time into it. No one was good at Risk of Rain 2 when they started either. I feel like it's easier to win streak in that game than this game, to be honest. And I think this game is easier. Hello. Give. That is what I want, you're right. Thank you. ICBM in the Legendary. What do you think? What do I hope he's doing next? I'm assuming we'll find out sooner than later. In the grand scheme of things, I don't know, it could be like six months, could be a year, but compared to probably when it's gonna be done, we'll see. $8,000. I'm gonna wait till the end of the stage. I wish you make a card game. I wonder what Mega Crit are doing next. The devs of Slay the Spire. Because they're working on their next game. And I feel like, personally, I'm really interested on that one. They have really good ideas. I should play the Shrine. Just in case there's a gun, we might get a uh, worm or something. Okay, well. Do I want the ignition tank? Nice. Please give me a Murph. I would personally very much enjoy it. This is where like Phase Run really just comes in, just like walking away. <laughs> and just slapping down Phase Run. See, oh, I need to get this speed. A word search roguelike, holy shit! I'm gonna be the best in the world at a fucking one of the roguelikes, dude. <laughs> not like uber amazing damage right now. Mind me to not forget the laser scope. I remember Mega Crit was pretty vocal about the Uni thing. Yeah. They were like. I remember what they said, They're like, we have never made an announcement before, ever. That's how bad you fucked up. <laughs> Shit, that was funny. I just threw that grenade through the wall, actually. Yeah, just did it again. <laughs> I was trying to throw it against the wall, but, uh, right. So what are we looking for in this? Because we don't need a feather. Or just a red of some sort. I would take another feather, but speed, some sort of damage. Hmm. Oh. We'll just take the fucking whatever. <laughs> Missed the fucking clover, dude. I got fucking sunlocked. By seeing it, I was like, oh shit, there's actually a rip. Well, no more free clover in this one. Guillotine. Dude, I wish there was scrapper. This shit out of my inventory. I don't want this. That's okay. I, I mean, that does more for us than the, uh, the scope did, so. Can't really complain. You, I can reroll. That's gross and it's bad. I don't really want the ignition tank either. Death mark. Let's see. We have needle tick. All right. <laughs> Let's get both of them. All right. I'm happy. I guess. Well, I'm not happy. I am accepting of the circumstances that we have found ourselves in. Uh, do you think the scope is generally bad, or just because you don't have a lot of crit? I have no crit, so it'd be awful. I also think it's not as good as it uh, really could be because it's about half as much crit damage as you'd expect out of uh, the item. Just because of the way the image is calculated or whatever though, it's like, it's, it's fine, but it's not like, great. Yeah, you prefer Commander's Grenade? Absolutely. It is way better if you know how to use it. If you don't know how to use it, it's way worse. It's, like, it's just like a non-skill, right? Can't hit anything with it, it's like, whatever. I didn't like it when I first saw it either, but after learning how to use it, I feel like it's, not only is it really fun, that's good. Alright, if this thing hits me, I die instantly, so I'd rather not. <laughs> I'd rather not. At least I have void stunts. Tesla helping out a little bit? I'm dead. <laughs> I get caught on the little rock, that's like... I'm not dead, actually. 
I'm leaving though. I'm gonna get caught in the fucking divot there, dude. Uh, I don't want this. I'm surprised. I thought two stacks would be enough to uh, instantly kill. I don't feel good about being alive right now. I would have calmly accepted death there for fucking up that bad. Uh, that's actually might be the solution to the predicament that we're in. Any character you don't care for syringes. Any character where you don't want to like shoot your gun. I mean, let's just go through like the list. Like Bandit, I like one syringe maybe because it speeds up Desperado. That's, that's not really a great reason for it. Multi is good with them. Engineer is good with them. Captain is good. Railgunner, it depends if you want to use it as a movement utility or not. Uh, loader, no. Acrid, no. Void Fiend, sure. Any melee character, I don't really care for them. Merc, it depends on if you're using Eviscerate or not, I guess. If it scales with the build or not. But I'm, but I'm usually using Sysimon, so usually no. Makes reloading easier? Yeah, but I mean, if you know the timing, it's the same anyway. Drone parts. If this is vanilla Mythrix, that's just like all you need to win. So. A red printer and it's a clover printer. Okay. So this is just clover day, I guess. I really wish we had something to really like work with it on this build. Uh, we did have ATGs earlier, but that was after the plump. Do we want drone man? I don't really even feel like I want drone man unless I get uh, MV Force. So I'm gonna leave that there for a little bit. I definitely don't feel like I want a base. Gun is perfect. Getting this key, so we can actually get the key box as well, here. Alright, well, we know what we found. That's a pillar to skip, so I don't need anything else anymore like that. Let's go for another gun before TP. Let's move you all the way somewhere safe. I don't reroll you, and I can reroll the cube. You know how many drones or drone barns wouldn't be that valuable? It could be. You don't know yet. We have a gun on the field, so if I get MV cores, that's immediately something I want to uh, keep drone parts for. Alright, card up. There are more rerolls coming in. Are there any other multi-shops anywhere? Don't use the card twice here. I don't think that uh, Elephant is bad. I need that for sure. Let's make Triple Omega sure that we're not missing out on any multi-shops. Should also play that shrine. Let's just play it now that we have a card in hand. There's a lot of chests over here, actually. There's a lot of extra stuff at this stage, which is really nice. Yeah, that's how we do it. Is Elephant better for Umbral than Capacitor? Maybe. Before the Clover Printer, Capacitor is better. I almost just fell through the ground. Um, I think after the cover printer, we can probably be fine with our amount of damage. We don't really need extra to pick up our service spaces. Thank you. All right. Another gun. Well, that's what we're looking for. I'll still never forget the day where I was just playing. And one of the devs came in chat and they were like, Hey, I'll give you five bucks if you can like put through a wall right now as commando. And I was like, okay. And I immediately clipped through a wall because you can just do that anywhere. <laughs> it was like, damn, all right. <laughs> Anywhere where there's a corner you can go through, by the way, like, let's see. Crit, wrong. I once co jumped at the wrong angle on engine and got soft blocked on Waspack, that sucks. <laughs> It happens. Shit's crazy. It needs to be thrown through walls. I think it's funny because like new players are like, what? How'd you go through the wall? And like any like veteran player would be like, oh, yep. <laughs> there they go again. I will take the thing. We don't have any watches, to be honest. One more, and then we have to wait for gun cooldowns too. God. Okay. Alright, let's take our first gun. Let's start up. No matter what it is, it does not matter, because we have a recycler, so we're getting boss items, that's the important thing. So let's see. 
I am very glad that I left the drone parts on the ground. Minus one clover, but plus a billion reliable damage. Alright, we'll reroll one of them. Maybe we'll even get another one from TP, you don't know. Maybe, maybe. Should probably print a clover before the boss, but I will then the core stack. Not well enough for me to take two of them. Plus, we have a clover, so I'd rather try to roll for something that works with our build a little bit better, besides just the drone man. And we got another one. Okay, we got three. Let's start rerolling the ones around here, probably. Or we roll two. Just praying we get a, a mer for a chirp or something. Low Disciple is really good. And Buclius. Yeah. We haven't had, like, that many good boss rolls today. This got a little Disciple. I wish I had a little bit more speed. And I wish I had really pulled that feather out of the, uh, the gamer chest. Because I feel like I need another one. Let's also look around completely on the stage before we, uh... Pick up the drone parts because there might be another red, and that might be another clover. So, oh yeah, there's one void cradle. This two, actually, my bad. I was being a little bit too harsh. Do I want another Neil tick straight up here? I don't know. Let's uh, get this one first. Let's see how we feel. There are spaces. I guess I just reroll. Neil tick. Okay. I don't want another key. I don't want another stair spaces. I don't really want anything. I'm gonna take the nail tick. It's probably the best for what I'm gonna get here. Crit. Finally we get crit. Clovers are actually gonna do something for that over time. What's the name of a lot of change to look at the maps? Stage aesthetic or something? No, it is called Cooler Stages. Opal's huge. And we need to pick up Drone Man's and the boss item. Alright. Alright. This is a good build. We need to look for the key, and then we need a host skip. Damage is way better. How much you don't take? We have six with two clovers on Mando with Plimp. Yeah, that's... That's alright. Let's see. I found the key box. Ooh, an afterburner would be really good. I might take it. Because at the end of the day, even if we lose our feather with the afterburner, um, another clover. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> even if we lose our feather, uh, it's still really powerful. We have to lose two greens for it. I think I might take it here. I don't want to lose the feather, but if I do, it's okay. That sucks. But we still have bands and shurikens, so it's not the end of the world. I do have a shorm still somewhere before we skip. Ah, man. Alright, the greed within me says... Go check what it is. A key! Wow. Guess we gotta do voiding, guys. Alright. <laughs> Alright, to a clean 1,000, 1,100 with the fucking... You know what? Good. Good steak. I went out forward way too far. Oh, I have the bug, man. <sighs> I have the bug where I have no boundaries on the world. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just pretend that I host skipped because the game's broken. So, what caused of this? I don't know. I don't remember. Something fucked up, though. I really want my serious base to come back soon. Where am I, of course? There we go. I have to remember that I only have one, um, feather. Dude, that shit is so annoying. I don't have enough damage to hit the orbs, so if they come near me, I just lose my saber spaces. I need to them way earlier.
Oops. Thought I could walk out of that fast enough. Cores are literally soloing the fucking the true mythics. almost really bad. <laughs> I couldn't see you, dude. Self, never put your camera outside of the fucking playable area. Thank you. Oh, I can't go through here either. Come on, man. Why is my game fucking busted right now? I'll even go to where I would spawn in on that portal, so. I don't know. I don't know either. I think if I just restart, it'll go back to normal, but. Mm. That would have been a soft lock, just forever trapped in the arena for the rest of the game and losing. <laughs> well, GG anyway. It wasn't that great. I think I played phase three really well. I think phase four today was really bad all the way through, obviously. And this last time I just felt like I blinded myself, so.